Hey, 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 what's happening, y'all? It's your boy Clark here, and in today's video, I'm taking you guys along as I check out a brand new barbecue spot that opened up here in Midtown Toronto. Let's go! It's time to get food. There's an alleyway near Young and Eglinton that I know you don't want to pass up if you've got barbecue on your mind. Benny's is Toronto's newest stop for no-nonsense craft smokehouse barbecue. They got your brisket, your ribs, sausage, turkey, and so much more. And I was eager to pull up and give it a try. wasting time we've got this chopped brisket sandwich here and we're absolutely gonna dive right in and get our meat sweats on mm. nice soft buttered squishy bun tangy barbecue sauce but as always with any good barbecue spot it's that beef brisket, that's where it's at. Any barbecue spot worth their salt is gonna be judged on their beef brisket. I've said that before, it's still true today. And this chopped brisket here, oh, they absolutely nail it. I mean, look at that meat right there. You got the bark, you can see that it's just glistening with all those meat juices. Look at it, it's just breaking apart in my fingers. So I started on just a backyard smoker, um, playing around with stuff, testing stuff out, and just, you know, cooking and using the smokers every day. Selling to neighbors, friends, just people in the community through Facebook groups, a, an email list, and just cooking in my parents' backyard and selling it once, twice a week for about seven months. And it went really well because I don't think there's much great barbecue in the area. So. Because of that, we decided to start looking for some space. Um, this space came up, it took us a while to get it, but now we're here. We got some pickles here as well. Mm. Nice and vinegary, the acidity really cuts well. Nice. They have your coleslaw here as well. Mmm, it balances out with the fattiness of the meat. Good stuff. Don't want to waste any of that meat. Falling out of the sides of the sandwich. Mm. Tender and juicy. So we try to use high quality meat, so our brisket is a really high quality, it's a US prime brisket. Um, I think a lot of other restaurants, because of the prices right now, they're using AAA, but we're using a really high quality because everyone, we want every slice to be perfect. And that's the best way to, you know, do that. It's just by using high quality briskets, we're smoking them for 12 to 14 hours, and then we're resting them overnight till they're served the next day, so the temperature comes down. All right, so we got some more food right here. I got one of their St. Louis side ribs. Mmm. So St. Louis side ribs are known for being a little more tangy, got a little bit more of that vinegar in the base in their sauce. And they don't go heavy with that sauce. Looks like they're really just relying on that bark that they developed from that dry rub. And that sauce is there just to add a little bit of just an extra boost of flavor, not really there to be the main thing. What they really do a great job of is really highlighting that pork rib flavor. Mmm. You can see just how tender the meat is. It just comes right off that bone. Mmm.
So Benny's Barbecue, they've only been open for but a couple of months now, not even. And I can see already, I can see that already they have that commitment to both the science and that craft of great Texas smoke. My passion for cooking transferred over into barbecue and I really like it because you can sort of focus on like the few main items which is you know your brisket, your ribs, your pulled pork and turkey so you can really focus on like a smaller menu to make sure everything is perfect rather than running a huge menu and suffering some quality loss there. All right, you know we had to do a little bit of that turkey too, right? Check it out, it's nice, thin sliced. Oh man, you can see it's just all seasoned all up in there. Mm. Turkey we really um, are proud about because it's not your typical dry turkey. Um, we brine it in the salt water brine and then we smoke it. So we're really happy about that. Oh man, this turkey is moist. It's juicy, great smoky flavor, but you get that turkey as well. Mmm, 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 mmm. More of the pickled veg. And there you go, plant-based. You know, no guilt, it's all balanced. We gonna do some cornbread too, right? Cornbread, nice and dense. Got that sweet corn flavor. Mm. made by our assistant pitmaster's mother at his house. So, totally homemade. So she does our cornbread cookies, key lime pie, banana pudding. We're trying to do like special desserts as well. So now we're doing a salted caramel cookie, red velvet's coming. All right, so there you have it. This has been my day here at Benny's Barbecue. I want to say a huge thanks to Benny and his whole team. These guys are awesome. Y'all got to come down here and try this food. If you guys enjoyed the video, then as always, please help us out, give it a thumbs up. If you haven't already, please subscribe and hit that bell icon and I'll catch you all next time when I get food.